A woman who was desperate not to be caught led police on a chase that was way beyond wild in Santa Fe. Spilling from city streets onto I-25 and then back to city streets. It's amazing no one was hurt, especially because the driver tried to run police over with her car as they tried to stop her. News 13 Selena Westervelt is live in the newsplex with the story and the video. Selena? Jessica and Dick, the video shows the female suspect driving dangerously, weaving in and out of busy traffic, even running red lights. It's clear she was determined to try and get away. It started Friday just before midnight. Santa Fe police tried to pull over a woman for driving erratically in a parking lot near St. Michael's Drive and Cerrios Road. You can see she wasn't going to stop. The woman takes off on Cerrios and zips onto I-25. The driver purposely drew across the double yellow lines onto uncommon traffic. Thankfully, nobody was hurt. When officers try to deploy spike strips to stop her, they say she tried to run them over. Watch as they scramble out of the way. They say this is the woman behind the wheel, 41-year-old Antonia Alvarez, and she just kept going. The chase uh, then came back into the main streets of Santa Fe onto uh, onto Rodeo Road and then Zia. That's when officers pulled out the spike strips again. This time it worked. Watch as Alvarez's green mercury zooms over them, but she's still not done. Once the vehicle came to a stop, Ms. Alvarez decided to once again uh, flee on foot. When police caught her in a yard nearby, they say they searched the car and it was riddled with drugs. Drug paraphernalia, heroin, uh, cocaine and hydrocodones. But police say that's not why she ran. She told them it was because she was wanted on shoplifting charges. Now she's charged with a lot more. How many counts? <sighs> Collectively, uh, Antonio Alvarez is charged with 21 separate counts. Now those 21 counts include aggravated fleeing, aggravated battery on a police officer, and drug charges. Police say there was a man riding with Alvarez in the car when the chase ended. He took off on foot as well. He is still on the loose. Back to you. All right, thank you, Selena. Police say one of 17 syringes found in the suspect's car was filled with heroin. They aren't sure if she was high during the chase.